Enrollment for next school year is open for students at Tulsa Public Schools, so we invited Superintendent Dr. Deborah Gist to be on the program to talk more about the upcoming enrollment events for families. It's hard to think already <laughs> about next year, but that's what you guys have to it's do. It's time. It's time. So whether you have a, a young child who's about to be four or a student in any kind of transition grade or a family just thinking about maybe making a difference or moving into Tulsa or joining one of Tulsa schools, now's the time. Enrollment is open. What are some of the things that parents should be aware of as they make these transitions? Mm -hmm. Well, I think for one thing, we want families to know that great things are happening in Tulsa Public Schools. Enrollment is up, student performance is up, many more opportunities. We're expanding career and technical education, advanced placement courses, concurrent enrollment, and there are programs all across the city where students can uh, leave our schools fully bilingual. They are uh, leaving our schools with a, a college degree at the same time they're earning a high school degree uh, certificates we have a new aerospace program I just visited yesterday at East Central High School that had a East Central had a waiting list wow this year for enrollment so great things are happening and we want families to know that we've made the enrollment process as seamless and painless as we possibly can uh, for families and we've had you know 95% of families have been really pleased with their experience and most families get their first choice more than 90% get their first choice for the school they'd like to attend. How many students now in the district? There are 30, uh, more than 33,000, mm -hmm. almost, almost 34,000 mm -hmm. students in the district. Enrollment is up again, even more up more this year than it was up last year and uh, so we continue to be the largest district in the in the state and uh, we know that's because our team in spite of the conditions in Oklahoma uh, just get up every morning doing an amazing job. The legislative session is going to get started here soon mm -hmm. and as the superintendent of the largest district, what are you hoping will happen in the coming session? You know, I've been so pleased with the messaging that we've been seeing, including yesterday, uh, the story you just read with Senator Pugh's announcement uh, about his priorities. Um, there is definitely, gratefully, I can say, a message that they realize that we have to do something about salaries for educators, but also for support professionals, and I think that's really important. You know, we are last in the region when it comes to what we spend on our students by a significant amount, um, and, it, and it shows. It, it shows up in our student experience and in the work that our teachers and principals do, and I'm grateful that legislators, um, that I'm hearing over and over again, that message um, is out there, and I feel confident um, that is that in this legislative session, especially given and the financial conditions the state has had that we'll see a difference. And we want everyone in, in Tulsa to make sure their legislators know that they want that too. Right, and reinforce that yes. messaging for sure. We want to let you know there's an event coming up this evening that, for uh, enrollment, and that's happening this evening at the Tulsa Dream Center, just so you're mm -hmm. aware of that. And that there will be members there that will help the family mm -hmm. start that enrollment process. There will be upcoming enrollment expos as well, a one-stop shop for families to learn about about enrollment in the district's uh, 78 un communities. Saturday, January 21st, 10 to 3 at the Tulsa Tech Peoria campus. February 4th from 10 to 3 at the T Tech Lemley campus. And the deadline to enroll? February 12th. So you've got to get that started soon. All right, yes. great to see you, Dr. Thank you, uh, you too, Guest, appreciate your time Thank this morning. Thank you.